but Sue is gonna show them how to do it. So you have to just remember this is called Mabu or Mabu, horse thing. It is one of the, the secret of of Shaolin Kung Fu. It's actually popular in many other kind of martial art disciplines as well. Okay. Okay. You think they got it? They got the effort they have there? Okay. Don't try that. Okay, everyone relax. Okay, not my students. Okay, for the new students. Are you ready? Show me Mabu. Show me Mabu. Everyone show me Mabu. Oh, very good. Okay. Next you learn is Dingbo. Okay, left is Dingbo. Dingbo. Your left heel up, left arm down, looking to your left. Okay, left and dingbo. Okay, so my students can help me. Can help me.
your toe, your back leg is straight. Okay, and without falling off the stage four. Okay, now you're in Mahabu, but you're facing the other way. And I'll show you the last trick. The tricky one is five. Five is called Shibu. Believe it or not, it is called the resting stance. Okay, so left foot behind the right. Your knee is behind your shin all the way down. And then you can rest on the heel of your back leg. If you're not flexible enough, you can go higher, that's okay. Eventually you develop the flexibility to go lower. Okay, that's it. So come back to one. Very good. Okay. Okay. Let's just move over this way a little bit. Okay, one, straight. Okay, two, mabu. Three, wagumbu. Four, tai jiao. And five, left shibu, left foot. Left knee behind the right shin. Very nice. Okay, very good. We're gonna do one more time. And then you can do it on your own together. Are you ready? Try to memorize this now. Okay. Okay, one. Two. Three. Four. Five. Left up behind the right. And finish. Come back up. Very nice. Okay. All right, my students stand on the side. Let's let's test them out.